How to Edit Sewing Pattern First, right-click the zip package which we send to you to release the zip package. Click File Released and click Setup. Click Install and Confirm. Close all of the files after installed successfully. Back to Desktop, find this icon and open it. Find the communication mode, click select mode, and click add. Click find calm, the code with AWC is what we need. Then click OK. Now, we can edit the graphic. This is toolbar. We can select the straight line. Press and hold control key. Move the mouse and draw a straight line. Click the rectangle. Press and hold left mouse key. Move the mouse to select the direction. Release the mouse to determine the location. Next, draw a oval. It's same way to draw oval and rectangle. Draw a straight line again for close. Then, we need to adjust the properties of these graphics. Click the Select Logo and select a graphic. You can adjust the width of the left and right of the graphics. For example, 60 mm. You can adjust the length of the graphic. Here is the x-axis. The x-axis represents the left and right coordinate values. It's the y-axis. The y-axis represents the upper and lower coordinate values. Fill 600 on x-axis, for example. Fill 800 on y-axis. We can adjust other graphics in turn. After the graphics are edited, we move the mouse to the upper toolbar. Find this icon. Click it. It shows the laser head is on the right of the graphic. Let's to check the blue dot. It represents the position of the laser point. Now the blue dot is on the right underscore up. Under normal conditions. We generally choose the center underscore up of the laser pen in the graphic. We select the center underscore up and confirm. Now, the blue dot is on the center underscore up. When the pattern edited finished, double click cut. Cut is on the right top of this software. A frame will pop up at this time, select laser one in the cut parameters. The value here represents the maximum and minimum power of the laser pen. Generally, we will set the maximum power to 80%. And the minimum power is set to 75%. The speed here means cutting speed. In the case of normal cutting, it can be set according to actual needs. Set value of laser 1 and laser 2. No need to set value of laser 3 and laser 4. Click OK key to confirm. Click Download. 
The file name of pattern can be set here. The value here represents the number of pieces of the machine's continuous cutting. Then click here. Hook enable or machine cannot feed material. Feed length represents pattern length. The value on the right represents the feeding length after one cutting finished. For example, if the value is set 10 mm, machine will feed material forward 10 mm after one cutting finished. Then the next round cutting will be continued. You can set it according to your actual needs. Click OK after setting finished. Remove the hook in this column. At last, click Save Document to U File. The format of file, please select UD5. Then save it in U Disk. Now let's back to operate screen. Open the rubber cover, insert a USB, which you have saved edited pattern in. Click menu. Then click UDisk files. Select work files. Select the pattern you need. Click Copy to System. Back to Home Page. Enter File again. Now the pattern has been uploaded successfully to Sewing Machine. If you have any additional question, or contact our engineer at info at automatic-sewing.com, thank you for your time.